Hey, 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 welcome, welcome back. We are back with another opening cards box breaking video. Um, I am going to be opening, let's see here, 2022 contenders, Panini contenders football. These are um, 400 something a box. You get 18 packs per box. Um, how many cards per pack? Let's see here. I don't really know. It doesn't say, right? I know you get five autos in this. That's kind of the big deal with these. Oh, there you go. Right there. Six cards per pack, five, 18 packs. So let me do the math. I'm bad at math. That's like 80 cards, right? Something. Um, you're getting one parallel, 18 inserts on average. Um, unwrap one on-card auto. And then I'm guessing the other four would be sticker autos. Now, if this is like my uh, Panini Phoenix box, I'll get a sweet 400-point card in like one auto or something um ages nine plus no purchase necessary see back for details um so if you're like over the age of nine you can just get stuff for free i guess um i'm, I'm highly done that as you can see that font is like you know one point font right you can't even really read it what what your thing is it says season playoff ticket championship blah 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 blah, blah. feature set including 160 rookie ticket 100 season set and 42 rookie ticket rps so not sure what all that means but it means there's a bunch of cards in here um as usual i do sell on ebay ebay selling cards collectibles please like subscribe share all that fun stuff with these videos i know i am not the only guy on the youtube's breaking open boxes i'm not even the most entertaining one by any means but i do appreciate the views and i just like opening cards and i figure might as well do it on camera um sometimes i open a lot of cards off camera and honestly i like to when when i get some situation like i had with that phoenix box i like to be able to go back and be like look at what happened um and have it on camera it's nice um anyways how's everybody doing how are you liking the things i'm trying to put out more content i keep on saying i promise i'll put out some like you know actual travel content video content of non-card stuff but um yeah that requires me actually having a life and doing something and currently my life consists of me doing just card stuff or being at work so not too exciting here um of my comings and goings so there's nothing really for me to be videotaping and putting out into the world let's start with our first pack season ticket season ticket season ticket so the season ticket's going to be our base all right first auto right out of the first pack who'd we get here david bell in is that my that is my on card auto is david bell right out of the first number 22 out of 22 if anybody knows what that means that means ebay one of one right there boy 22 out of 22 david bell and it is like the crack ice on card auto of david bell uh honestly i hate to say it don't know who david bell is but let's go ahead and sleeve him up since he is somebody kind of fancy We'll put him right there. And then we got a Patrick Mahomes MVP insert. Uh, not a bad pack if you were buying that by the pack. I bought two packs of this at the shop. And oh boy. One I got an auto. One was just just a total blah pack. So it was one of those. I, I don't even remember how much these were running. 30 something bucks a pack. So it was one of those where I got my 30 bucks worth. And then didn't get my 30 bucks worth. All right, upside down again. Season ticket, season ticket, season ticket, season ticket. Just one insert. Let's double check. Yep. Ah, there you go. There's a blah pack. Just got this plain insert. Nothing fa fancy here. For round numbers, Chris Olave and Drake London. Rookie card technically. But those don't really go for much. Those tend to be things I'll throw in my quarter bin. I will be doing the Colorado Springs show in two weeks. <clears throat> I'll be doing the big Denver cards show at the end of the month. I am trying to get out and do more card shows again. Go to trade nights, things like that. 
season ticket, season ticket, season ticket, season ticket. And hey, there's a cool one. Patrick Mahomes, Supernatural. Insert numbered. For 84 out of 99. And that one actually even looks different. I don't know if this is the new style of them. But this might be like the Galactic insert. I mean, it's got kind of a cool look to it. So that is a cool card. I'm very much digging that. Um, I got a top loader right there. Let's top load him real quick. And let me horrify you by pushing it down with my finger. Some people are like, oh, you, you should always tap, 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 tap. And they'll have like gloves on. Remember that? That was a thing for a little bit. I remember watching people, especially during the card break with like gloves on. It's like, man, unless you're opening packs with, you know, Michael Jordan rookies or something in them. You don't need to have that. Gladiators, Ronnie Lott, not numbered. Sleevable, though. So we've gotten two cool cards. I'm a big Patrick Mahomes fan. I am a Cal I'm a... Calgary Flames fan in hockey, and I'm a Chicago Bears fan. But, you know, I always like Mr. Mahomes. He is pretty awesome. There's a Russell Wilson base. All right. Our second auto, sticker auto, Zachary Carter of the Bengals. I'm going to assume by number 95 he is some kind of lineman. That is nothing to go crowing home about by any means. I Usually you don't want to offensive lineman or a defensive lineman's auto but there you go sticker auto rookie card of zachary carter Devonte adams Derek carr touchdown tandems well Derek carr is not gonna be throwing touchdowns to Devonte adams anytime soon he got trade he got let go he got his bank good old jeff mcdaniels being the jeff mcdaniels of old gets rid of his quarterback lets him walk away with a ton of money and he gets to go play for the saints where he'll probably have a stellar year. All righty. Season tickets. Tyler Algier, rookie card. He was a good rookie last year. I had him on my fantasy team. He, I didn't start him a bunch, but, I mean, he ended up, he ended up playing pretty well as the season went on. So we got an Algier rookie out of that pack. We're going from one good pack to one blah pack. One good pack to one blah pack. And I'm not saying like an Algier rookie card. That's probably five bucks. But if you had paid $36 or something for the pack, you would be kind of bummed out. There we go. We got a Cooper Cup auto. Let's see, is it? It's not numbered. Cooper Cup auto. That is my second Cooper Cup auto out of panini products recently my first box of of a uh, of a uh, phoenix when they dropped that first day i always run out and buy my first box of phoenix um that literally i pulled the Co cooper cup out of that too so um, i'm hopefully he has a good year again uh did not have a good year last year and then of course had that crazy stellar year the year before uh who do we get here eddie george ray lewis um some kind of you know Guys that are retired card. Not sure what you'd call that. Kind of cool, though. All right. Who'd we get here? Season ticket, season ticket, season ticket, season ticket, season ticket. And a touchdown tandems. Amon Ross St. Brown, Jared Goff. Nothing special there. Season ticket, season ticket, season ticket, season ticket, season ticket. And then we got the game day ticket insert of Mr. Aaron Rodgers, who is not yet, but is supposed to be pretty soon a New York Jet. All right, let's 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 look at our base cards here just to make sure we're not missing any rookies or something, because it's kind of weird that we haven't pulled any base rookies. So um, I don't know how many packs we open, five, six. So let's make sure... I'm going to say any of these have like an RC or anything on them. Let's look. As usual, playing some jazz. I played the upbeat jazz this time around. 
Figure that's nice background music. Yeah, none of these are any kind of rookie. That is kind of funny, though, that they these came out later on in the year, so Baker Mayfield's on the Rams in those. Now he is a uh, Tampa Bay Buccaneer. I mean, they even got Kadarius Toney, who got traded midway through the season. Yeah, none of these are rookie cards. Maybe it says, like, rookie ticket or something, but it is. So we have ended up with, in our X amount of packs, we got some inserts, and, um, I mean, I guess... One of my autos is a rookie. Then we got the Supernatural. One of my autos is a rookie. That's a rookie. And then we got an auto. So, not a lot of rookies so far being pulled. Just base rookies. Maybe maybe we'll get some loaded packs. But it's kind of weird that every one of those packs is just base cards and then one insert. Usually you'd get a couple rookie tickets. Right? Or something. None of those were rookies. And then just one insert. So, well, I'm going to say it. I mean, if you pulled one of those ones that had, like, the auto or something, great pack. But if, like, that was a pack right there I just paid, I don't know, 35 bucks for. And I got five base cards and then one Gladiators insert that maybe is worth three bucks. Two, three bucks. I mean, I'm probably going to throw that in a dollar bin, honestly. And just let it go. But, I mean, that's kind of uh, weird. Did they forget rookies? Because I'm not getting, I'm literally not getting any rookies. Is this just my box? Like, uh, comment below if you opened some of this contenders and you didn't get any rookies. There's a legendary insert. Like I said, again, base cards, one insert. Like, usually you'd get, I don't know, two, three base cards, maybe two rookies per pack. I mean, I've opened plenty of contenders over the year. Oh my gosh. And then sometimes the packs are like Fort Knox. Oh, finger update. It's uh, not getting better. It's looking even grosser now. Um, it is still being Sharpie colored black at this point, And I'm just layering uh, super glue on top of it. I mean, all these are season tickets. There's another Supernatural. All right. So the Supernatural is, that's what it looks like. It is not... My Mahomes one was numbered, which makes it cooler, but it is not some kind of super rare insert. Kyler Murray, I'm a, I am like I'm an OU guy. I like OU. I, I don't know if Kyler's going to have an amazing bonafide career, but they sure paid him like he's going to. So here's to Kyler having a good season and being relevant again. Unfortunately, they are a complete dumpster fire of a team. And there's Mr. Kyler again. Yeah, look, we're not getting any rookies. None. We got two cards stuck together. All right, we got an auto here of Nicobe Dean. I have ended up, there's another rookie. So is the rookies only inserts in this product this year? What is going on here? That is very weird. But we got Nicobe Dean. Decent player right there. And who was our kind of regular insert? A regular insert was, is that Mr. Jerry Rice again? It's Mr. Jerry Rice again on a game day ticket. I never know how to put those in those things. All right, game day ticket. So for, I mean, this is, like I said, this is like a $400 something box. What is going on with Panini? We Let's see if we get one base rookie. Nope, nope, nope. Wait, is this our first or is this going to be an auto? He's flipped around, so he's an auto. Percy Butler. And look at that auto. He didn't even stay on the sticker. And it is pretty... That, that's pretty janky looking auto, honestly. That is the rookie ticket auto. So there's our... Another rookie card, at least. We're not getting any base rookies. And an MVP. We're down to like six packs left. There's out of the 18. We've opened 12 packs. We've got no base rookies. Is is base rookies just not a thing now in contenders? Or I mean I I'd, I'd be 
fine with that, I guess. I don't know. Does that make a base rookie more rare now in a contender's season ticket, season ticket, season ticket, season ticket? I mean, none of those guys, J.J. Watt, Derrick Henry, none of those guys are that. There we go. We got an Aiden Hutchinson rookie, Supernatural. That's a pretty cool card. I mean, I'll take that all day. I mean, is this a good box or is this a bad box? I don't know. What am, what am I? I mean, I'm okay with it. I'm getting some cool inserts. Not a lot of regular inserts right there. I'm going to continue opening Panini products because I keep on getting hosed on these things. Season ticket, season ticket, season ticket, season ticket, season ticket. No rookies in those. And a Saquon Barkley MVP. Just one. Like, that's the crazy thing. Some of these packs is just literally one. I thought it was the just two random packs. Like I said, I bought two random packs at the shop I work at, Mike Stadium Sports Cards, Aurora, Colorado. And I thought, okay, I got hosed on one pack because I literally just got one insert and I got no rookies. And then the other one, I did get like a rookie auto and like an insert. So I was like, all right, out of six, I got three cards out of 12 cards. Like not a great percentage, but I figured it was just that. But I've yet to pull a base rookie card. Power players, Jamal Adams. That's kind of a cool card right there. Uh, I know somebody... He is my brother, and he lives in the Seattle area, and he might be getting this card eventually because that is a Seattle football player card, and it's kind of cool looking. So we're going to even sleeve that up for you, Tony, when you watch this video. you got a cool Jamal Adams coming your way. We should look at the, um, at the checklist thing that it's got. Does it even... Like, what's it list? Does it list any base rookies? Season ticket, like there's Mooney, there's Smith, there's Swift, there's Kelsey. And then that's got to be an auto. So we got an auto of Curtis Hodges. Man, what is with the, um, this is like a Washington box also. The commander skins, football commander skins. I mean, I don't, I'm not exactly stoked about that. Um, and then what was our other insert? We got a Justin Jefferson winning ticket insert. Not numbered. So let's put that guy in a top loader. I got a buddy that's a big Justin Jefferson fan, so you know that's some trade bait right there. I could trade probably a hockey card or something for it. Maybe a cool Star Wars card. I did open a box of T206 Star Wars cards. They were alright. Alright, Debo Samuel and Najee Harris, Corderell Patterson, Darren Waller. Again, no rookies. Oh, there we go. We got a rookie of the year. Of, of uh, Kenneth Walker the third. And again, Mr. Sullivan, my brother. You will probably be getting that one. Um, all right, last pack. And so, you know, what, what, what is 6 times 18? 60 and then 16, 32. So 92 cards. How many rookies have we gotten? Out of 92 cards, we haven't gotten... We didn't get one base rookie. And then we got a Micah Parson power player. It's kind of a cool looking card too. Let's, let's actually look at the stats on this thing, all right? All right, let's go over our cards here. That is all the packs. So we have, let's just separate the rookies. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So we got eight rookie cards, all inserts of some kind. Um, we got the cool, let's see how many numbered ones we got. Um, which I never know. They used to put like, the, this is 22 out of 22. So that's one numbered card. Um, any of these numbered on the front. See if they're numbered on the back. All right. So we got one, two numbered cards. 
not numbered. How many autos do we got also? Let's keep those. One, two, three, four, five, six. So we got six autos out of a box that's supposed to have five. Okay, I'll take that. Winning ticket, winning ticket. Let's look at our kind of base inserts here. That's what I call these. I mean, I get some of these can be worth something, but uh, to me, a lot of the time, these are like dollar or even eventually quarter bin cards. Nothing's numbered on the front. None of them. I guess technically that's a rookie. So we got what? Well, we have, what were we up to? Nine rookie cards now? See if there are any of these are numbered. I mean, heck, we might as well stick that. Apparently, they're so apparently rookie cards are so rare in contenders. I need to this thing that used to end up in the quarter bin as a rookie card is going to go in a top sleeve because there you go. I mean, that's a cool cracked ice number twenty two out of twenty two auto. On card auto rookie card. Unfortunately, it's David Bell, which is not anything to crow home about. But let's look at our base card pile. I mean, this is too. That's the base card pile. That's your hits. I mean, it's a low percentage, but let's let's double check, make sure we got any rookie cards. We're not seeing an RC on any of these. I'm not seeing rookie ticket on any of these. They're all Season tickets, pardon the noise upstairs. All season tickets. Season, 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 season. Not seeing any gold versions, any purple versions. Usually you used to even get those. And this is a hobby box. This is not like retail or anything like this. This I ordered... This from Dave and Adams on pre-sale for like four oh nine. They were going for like four eighty nine. So I mean, you're talking about almost five hundred dollars for this box if you're gonna like come into the shop and buy this. It's almost five hundred dollars. So that is all just base rookie. I mean, base cards right there. Let's see what the box said. So the box said unwrap one on card auto. We got that. Find one parallel and 18 inserts. So did we get 18 inserts? Let's look. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. There's a pile there. So we got 18 inserts. We got extra inserts, in fact. Um, where's my magnifying glass? Let's see what this says, though. Features a 302 card set, including 160 rookie tickets. So we got zero rookie tickets out of an entire box, or maybe one or two. Uh, 100 season tickets and 42 rookie, rookie tip it, ticket RPS. So we didn't get any rookie ticket RPS. I mean, I guess technically one or a couple of those were rookie tickets, right? But they were all auto. So that's the funny thing is all our only rookie tickets out of the 160 rookie tickets were autographed ones. 100 season tickets, which, I mean, that's almost 100 right there. And then we got season playoff ticket, championship ticket, cracked ice, uh, Super Bowl, blah, blah, blah. I mean... Let's, I mean, it's listing a bunch of stuff on here, but we didn't get any of that. We didn't get one base rookie. So um, I don't know what to say. I'm kind of annoyed because usually out of this stack, you know, you'd have that many rookies, you know, or that many rookies at least or something of just base rookies. And, you know, some of those guys are two, three, four bucks. But every one of my packs, you saw it. Every one of my packs I opened was basically five base cards and one, you know, insert and then you know if we did get this we got this and maybe an insert and then like four base rook four base cards so i'm gonna say a big to this box um i don't know if they're all like this comment share this around let me know i want other people 
to comment or at least watch this video and it's not even out of like, hey, this is monetized, please give me money kind of thing. I want to know if I am the only one or if there's other people that have had the same thing with Panini Contenders football. All right, thanks for watching. Like, subscribe, buy, whatever, all that fun stuff. And uh, catch you on the next video.